Hello, I'm Justin Fisher. Here's a look at some of today's top stories from 2 News Oklahoma. In this afternoon's Project Safe Schools, Muskogee High School students are learning from home today. The district says it's because of a water line break found overnight on campus. All other Muskogee schools will continue as normal. Also in Project Safe Schools, the pandemic, it continues to make parents think twice about sending their children to school. A Census Bureau report shows School enrollment fell by nearly 3 million students in the first year of the pandemic. The Bureau says the decline was the largest in more than 20 years. That report, it shows kindergarten enrollment fell from 4.1 million in 2019 to 3.7 last year. Preschool enrollment, that went down by more than a million students. College enrollment, that fell to its lowest level since 2007. And the CDC, warning of a salmonella outbreak linked to onions. The CDC says red, white, and yellow onions were imported from Chihuahua, Mexico and sold to restaurants and grocery stores all across the country. They were last imported in August. However, the CDC says they can last up to three months, meaning they could still be in your home or business. So far, at least 98 cases have been linked to the onions in Oklahoma of Salmonella. The CDC says throw away any onions that do not have a label saying where they were from and wash any onion or any uh, surface of that onion had touched. All right, let's check for, uh, take a look at your weather with uh, meteorologist Brandon Woolley. Brandon. Hi, Justin. For today, mostly sunny skies right around 70. Light northerly winds between 5 and 10. And a look at Oktoberfest. It looks wonderful for tonight. Eventually, those temperatures down into the 50s. Mainly clear skies. The morning low in T-Town at 46. Your latest 10-day forecast tomorrow night and Saturday morning. Chance for showers and storms. 83 for this weekend. Another chance for showers and storms next week. And maybe some severe activity Sunday. Justin. All right, thank you. Let's look at some stories making headlines today. Stay with 2 News Oklahoma for updates all throughout the day.